Hello guys, welcome to another time out with me on the channel. My name is Alec Godwin if you're here for the first time and today we are talking about the Ursa Mini Pro 12K. Two issues that you need to know about this camera before you grab it, coming up. Alright guys, if you're here for the first time, welcome. Uh, today we are going to run through the Ursa, not true. It's still not a review. I haven't done a review. I just wanted to let you know a little bit about this camera uh, because I have been getting a lot of messages like I'm pulling on the plug, I'm getting the Ursa 12K and uh, it's good. I have no regrets, but I just wanted you to know so you don't complain. Two problems. Number one was already out there. Uh, Epic Light Media put it out there when they did the review and the camera will always um, start up recording on its own. It happened to me one time when I was doing a shot. Uh, I'll put the uh, clip of the video here so you remember that shot. We, um, about three times during the recording, I think after the camera got a little bit warm, it started coming on on its own, like pushing the record button and I'll turn it off. And after a while, while we're getting ready for the next shot, it comes back again and hits the record button, whoever that is, whoever the invisible man, I don't know. But that happens and you need to watch out. The second problem is the camera comes on, on its own, even while the button here is up. And, I've, and I recorded a couple of times to show uh, what exactly goes down. It comes on, on its own, my God. And while the power is still off, the camera comes on. When the battery is attached, or surprisingly, recently, I found out that it also happens even with the direct power source. Now initially I thought this that was because of this um, stuff that we put at the back of the camera uh, when we were doing the, um, um, the VMAT mount. Okay, you know, I, I, I mounted this on my own. We had to do some screen. I showed the video uh, on the channel before. I thought that was uh, maybe it went into the internals and somehow it gets free access. So I talked about a VMAT battery that has power on and off on the side so you could cut the power. And I gave you guys a suggestion and I'm gonna apologize for that because that is not a true solution because uh, it does not cut out the VMAT battery. For a long time it didn't happen and then one day it occurred to me that it happened again and that button was turned off. I'm talking about a VMAT battery. When you don't use this, you connect this on rails and use a VMAT battery, regular VMAT battery and connect your, your DTAP to the power to power the camera that way. So just a point of correction, it doesn't solve the problem. But you can also take the battery off, off, off this one when you're not videoing or recording. So that's probably the best solution. The truth is it doesn't always happen, but it comes like when you least expect. It comes like once in, in five shoots or once in six shoots and randomly it's just, in, and then when you turn it off, when you turn it back on and off again, it goes off for a few seconds and comes right back on again. So those are my two issues with the camera. I will appreciate uh, Blackmagic to like give us tips on how to manage this issue or, pro or probably get us a VMAT battery or a power pack that has that power turned off and on um, so we can cut out the power that comes into the camera for sure. So that's what I wanted to share. So if you're gonna get this camera, know that it is easy, it is lovely, I love it. I can do run and go with it, look at it, like I can, I can build it up, I can break it down and it's a lot better, more comfortable for me to grab this one and get more stable shot than with my pocket 6K Pro. 
still from black magic uh we appreciate you guys we just need you to you know finish up the the work that you started okay mm, i love it i love it but just know before you get it those are the two main problems in probably uh, almost a year now it, no complaints besides those it's still working if you if you know these problems and you can tackle it you'll be fine thank you guys for watching like subscribe and i'll see you in the next video